friends so today's video we're gonna be starting out with doing some laundry and then we are gonna move on to the kitchen countertops finally they're gonna be getting done you guys I can't even lie to you I'm super excited and just ready to be done with this kitchen so in this video you guys will see the final finished result for the kitchen and then you guys we finally got some couches you guys are not gonna believe um, where and how much and then we're gonna go ahead and finish the video off with other things but let's go ahead and jump into the video i hope you guys enjoy it don't forget to comment like and subscribe and let's get into it bye <laughs> Alrighty guys so first things first we are going to be pulling out the stove that way it doesn't get any paint or anything on it we are going to be painting the countertops and um, making them look like marble i went ahead and picked up this kit that i seen off of tiktok i literally watched so many videos so i didn't even look at the instructions or anything like that i just kind of went over them the night before so we're going to be sanding the countertops down taping them off putting the um, plastic drop cloth and we're going to start painting this bad boy and getting rid of this nasty crusty looking yellow countertop that is so ghetto stove back in which i have to clean you guys it looks so ghetto this is how it is looking you guys look at that shine like i literally can't get over how shiny it is it is literally stunning so it's so smooth it'll stay like shiny smooth just like that it came out perfect so beautiful finally we're moving on to putting on the cabinet doors you guys i'm not even gonna lie to you this was such a process but it was worth it i'm so proud of myself i can't believe i did this entire kitchen all alone by myself and we are finally done here is the end um results you guys don't forget to follow me on instagram because instagram seen it before you guys did um but yeah this is how it is looking we got to get some decor in this baby and we are good to go I am literally lost for words right now. So I went to the thrift store because I was trying to see if I can find um, maybe like some decor. Like for instance, you see that little guy right there? That was actually purple. And I went and um, painted it. And I was just trying to find like stuff like that or whatever for a floating shelf that I have in the kitchen. And um, when I went, I see that they had furniture. So I was like, hmm, let me see if they have maybe something cute. So then you guys, let me show you what I picked up. You guys, this couch is so beautiful. I actually found this couch at the goodwill and it's pottery barn and it's practically brand new i was literally lost for words i couldn't believe it i also picked up this little green bissell um upholstery cleaner because i wanted to give the couch a good clean they're so beautiful you guys they're like practically brand new which is crazy to me the only thing um literally that's dirty is like this area right here i can't believe this couch is from pottery barns and someone just literally gave it away to the thrift store and it's crazy because i was there when they were like dropping it off and i was asking them about it and they said they had no pets um or anything like that so beautiful I got the couch for a hundred dollars. I'm gonna pop in with the couch. How much the couch actually cost? Um, the couch is over five thousand dollars, which is nuts to me, and I couldn't believe that um, I was able to find this. So it does have um, like a weird like stain from when they were moving it. Actually, when I pulled up at the thrift store, they were actually loading it into the thrift store. So the only big thing is right here from the truck. All right, so jumping right in, you guys, we are gonna go ahead and clean this bad boy. This Abyssal machine is literally amazing, you guys. I will leave it linked down below i couldn't believe how clean it actually made the couch and all of the little marks were gone I want 
wanted to show you I wanted to show you the dirt that was in the couch now it's so crazy because the couch don't even look dirty but I guess it was so we're gonna go ahead and dump it out yeah all right, friends, so I really quick wanted to show you guys how the couch came out, how it's looking after being dirty, but it looks amazing. So good, you guys. Look at this. I can't believe it. It's crazy. All right, guys, so really quick, I'm going to show you guys what I picked up from Target. I only grabbed a few things. Um, it was really like what we needed, I guess you can say, but I did find like a bed set that was... Um, it was on sale and you guys it's from um a thrush i think it's thresh and hold thresh and hold sorry um so let me show you guys a really quick one i got all right so um actually i just remembered i did stop at walmart to pick up the steam cleaner for the couch i forgot to show you guys the other few things that i picked up so um i got the steam cleaner as you guys would have seen it um but i also did pick up some um flatware it's a flatware set i don't know it's just um some utensils and um i felt like even though we do use a lot of plastic i did want um some some silverware just because i feel like you know it's just nice to have in case we don't we run out of plastic wear also i did go ahead and pick up some cook like uh these are cookie sheets but bacon like sheets or whatever um and then um i felt like we needed that moving on to what i got at target um i went ahead and picked up this is from magnolia this is a serving board but i think i'm gonna go ahead and put it in the coffee area because i've been using the same little wooden spinner for about two years now and i wanted something different so i figured i would pick this up and maybe just decorate it a little bit you guys everything was 20 percent off the decor was 20 percent off so i was like oh that's not bad plus the serving tray was super affordable anyway and then i also picked up this cute little coffee pot thingy i guess you want to call it i'm not exactly sure what they call this but this is where i'm not going to store regular coffee because i don't use coffee grounds but i will put like my little coffee pods in there and i thought this was such a cute little like wooden touch it's so pretty you guys i love it and then for the um countertop i picked this little guy up because i figured i could decorate it and put like this on the countertop um there's like an uh area on the countertop that's like super further back and it's very plain so i got this for that um and this was super affordable you guys um and i actually seen them on amazon and i was like mm, i want it today um it's you know just the, the aesthetics and like the vibe i did go ahead and pick up some paper towels but i already put one on there but yeah i got another one here and then moving on, I went ahead and picked up some paper plates. I got like the cheap ones just for like, you know, basic food, nothing crazy, nothing hot, um, mainly for the kids. And then I picked up forks um, and spoons. As you guys can see, this was super affordable as well. I did pick up some sponges. You guys, I love these sponges. I think the color is just so neutral and it's just a vibe. Like, look at it. <laughs> it's pretty. I like how it's like nude. And then I picked up some Ajax. Um, I'm going to be honest with you. I love Ajax. I like it because it's a super degreaser. And I feel like this works better than the other stuff. You guys. Look how cute. <laughs> it's so little. It's so cute. I think I'm going to put this um, maybe in the coffee bar area. And I was thinking of getting like the little spoons. Because I don't have any spoons to like stir my coffee up. And that is something that like bugs me. I picked up this water bottle. This glass water bottle with a wooden top. Because I thought it was super like pretty and i figured it would kind of encourage me to drink more water if i'm being honest with you i'm really bad with that and then last but not least i had to pick this up because i figured if i'm gonna get this i gotta get this like it it pairs perfectly and i love that both of the wood tops are different like wood finishes they're so pretty so excited to redecorate the coffee bar area i feel like i definitely needed it so i went ahead and got this you guys this was a originally a hundred dollars and i got it for 48 dollars. i really wanted to get something that was like more clean looking and just like airy if that makes sense and let me give you guys a close-up of what it looks like you guys i'm super excited it says that it comes with a one comforter two standard shams one decorative pillow and a decorative throw so i thought that was actually pretty cool because i've never bought like a sheet set that actually came with a throw but yeah so um i hope you guys enjoy um i'll see you guys in a little bit
right guys so this is the plates it's just a steak taco with some cilantro and some um onions and then we have um shrimp and rice all right friends so that is the end of the video i hope you guys enjoyed i'm getting ready to wash my hair and do my hair so that'll be like part two of like a day in my life so yeah i hope you guys enjoyed the video i need to get my hair washed and get my shit together and i'll see you guys in the next vlog bye guys peace